Okay, we are in the 14th uh, week of construction, three and a half months. We're here in the garage of Unit B, and I just wanted to show we can see some drains coming down from the uh, sun deck. They're on the wall of the houses in between the two units. Uh, there's a hole in the ceiling. I would guess this is where the sun deck trellis came down. Uh, so there are two drains here. We'll walk through the utility room, and I want to show what the uh, windows, uh, the new windows, look like in the study. Um, you can see the uh, wood framing around. It actually looks very nice on the inside and can be painted. Um, the windows do have screens. I'll give a close-up of the uh, crank mechanism. Uh, the windows are operable. Uh, we'll go in here as a detail of how they're going to finish with the drywall around them. Uh, you can see the lights a little better out here in the foyer, uh, what the framing looks like all around. And um, I will head out into the courtyard. We'll look at them from the outside. So this is that same study window. The vinyl has to be white and should not be painted or it voids the warranty. Uh, Zoe Shield, world's best energy glass, a lifestyle of comfort and so on. They're filled with uh, inert argon gas, I believe. Um, and they're double pane. I'm going to give a quick look up at the uh, upper window in the courtyard. It has a big cross in it. This is the master bedroom window. The bottom two I think are not operable and the top two are. We'll spin around and look at the living room windows. You can see the uh, glass surfacing is a little bit reduced. Uh, this is what the windows look like uh, down below. Can't really get back much farther. Um, so just to give an impression of what's going on, uh, maybe a detail of the flashing down below. If anyone's interested, that troublesome corner where leaks tend to happen. And um, I will end it here and we'll do a walk around outside.